This woman scratched by a rusty nail while helping renovate a friend's house. And Dr. Batra, what happened? So this one also is a really unfortunate one. It's called necrotizing fasciitis. And so necrotizing, as you might guess, means death or dying of the tissue. And the fascia refers to the sheath overlying your muscle. So this can be caused by a number of different types of bacteria. In this case, it was actually caused by black mold that was found in her bloodstream. Wow. But the idea is you just get this very aggressive infectious agent. Most common is actually something called group A strep. And it just seeds and it can go incredibly Incredibly quickly, you can develop fevers. You can be really quite sick and almost septic from this. But um, very challenging because the treatment for this is actually surgical because you have to go in and, and take you out. You have to that remove dead all tissue. that tissue. And why is it called fasciitis? Because it's an inflammation, infection of that fascia, that covering over muscle, which forms tissue planes. It follows that tissue plane. That's why it can spread so so yeah. quickly. True emergency because it spreads and gets seated in that fascia like you said to treat it very often you have to do uh, aggressive removal of the tissue it also highlights how the surface appearance of a wound can be misleading that very first picture we showed you looks so gruesome on the surface but this even more dangerous because of what's going on underneath yes it didn't look right you hopefully all would go see a doctor with that but it just looked like a bit of a bruise with some surrounding redness, but underneath those deep layers where all the madness is occurring. So that's why if you see a wound like that and you, oh, I don't remember hitting, I don't remember hitting my leg and maybe you don't even remember the rusty nail. You go to the ER right then and there and, um, and hope that you can keep your leg. Yeah, no, these are, these are serious, devastating, fast spreading infections for sure.